What's up guys, uh, welcome back to the next video on uh, learning bootstrap. My name is QDS Danny and you guys watching my channel Karayawood. Alright, so in the previous uh, video we have done uh, our um, website. So first thing first, you guys go ahead and uh, fire up your ZAMP. Alright, so in the previous video we have done this uh, row and the calls and we have created these two calls here and we have still have uh, these two calls but the problem is that we uh, don't have a pictures images and so far we're using the old images we actually already use it up there inside our uh, carousel and so far we have relying on just the four pictures so in this uh, video we're gonna go and uh, see how we're gonna download our pictures all right so i'm here at the pixabay you guys can um, type uh, free images and there are like i think there are four or five websites which offer free images so you guys can uh, copyright it and you guys uh, sorry uh, free copyright it um, there is no obligation or anything you can you guys can use it anywhere in your website testing purposes anywhere so i just went on so pixabay and i typed product shop you guys can uh, type uh, e-commerce product shop or uh, product e-commerce or anything and you guys see here the 314 free images for uh, product shop and you guys see all the apples and everything for uh, e-commerce and i have chosen three um, photos and the first one is this uh, shoes uh, the second one there is a laptop uh, the second one is this one beauty salon chairs and the third one is this uh, donut and the fourth one I'm not sure where is the fourth one around here somewhere I think there was a watch the fourth one anyway I chose uh, four pictures to save time I have already downloaded the pictures so because my window is a bit slow alright so once you guys go ahead here and the fourth one is this one yeah so once you guys go ahead here and when you press so what you do is that this free download and make sure you guys 1920 or 1280 you guys can choose any any size mix uh, but I don't use this one 2000 23 4, 9 because too big I think 1920 and 1280 is pretty perfect for this uh, for our website even 640 is perfect because uh, there's going to be small thumbnails and when we go to for a single product we're going to need this much big but anyway you guys can go and download you don't have to download what I downloaded you guys can go and download your own uh, pictures any from any other websites as long as you guys um, happy all right I'm here at my download and I've you guys see that I have downloaded the four pictures and what I'll do is that I'm going to select all these uh, uh, four pictures and you guys go ahead and um, select these four pictures that you guys downloaded from this uh, Pixabay website so as you guys see the window is a bit slow and what I'll do is I'll copy then I go to localhost and I'm going to ZAMP and you guys can go to HT documents and you guys find the salon or any website that you guys chosen uh, so you guys any website that you guys named and you guys see that's our pictures and I'm gonna add three more pictures you guys can create another um, say um, another folder all right so you guys go ahead and you guys can create uh, another folder so we, I'm going to new and I'm gonna put another folder and I'm gonna put an e-com because uh, I'm gonna put my e-commerce photo separate so what happens you guys if you guys put all your photos in one place and don't create a folder you guys gonna be at the end uh, you guys end up with lots of lots of pictures without knowing uh, which pictures sitting where so you guys go ahead and paste the pictures here and you guys see I've got a four pictures and for uh, simplicity purposes because I'm gonna put them in the websites I'm gonna rename all 
so this one's gonna be beauty salon and they all uh, keep in mind the all jpg files because they are different formats like some of them are uh, csv don't download csv or uh, uh, gif you don't download the graphic ones i think jpg is good and jpg is all right so it's normal so it's called desert that's a donut and there is another one you guys uh, renaming there is hipster and there's idea i think that's a laptop one all right so once you all right so we've got four pictures in our ecom folder and we go ahead and uh, put this in our website so what we do is that um at here calls instead of lotus.jpg if you guys open the e-commerce and you guys see here and we put a stylish watch and you guys can put this uh, say uh, desert and because we already created one uh, more folder so that our folder is going to be econ that's the folder name and it's going to be say uh, desert dot jpg and the rest is going to be all right so we're going to see how our uh, new picture is going to look and you guys see that uh, we have created this um, nice looking picture here and we're going to go is going to you guys going to go ahead and uh, change the title so instead of stylish watch we put a uh, we put a sweet donut okay so and you guys can go ahead and try to minimize this just a little bit like that so and I'm going to show you guys how to create the rest and if you come here and also minimize this we put a three line that is continue and what we do is that we go ahead IMG and after IMG is we're going to put our new folder which is ecom and on the new ecom we're going to put a beauty salon beauty salon jpg and here stylish chairs we put up all right so we look at gonna check okay so it looks like there is a problem with our um, photo saloon okay it's double O all right so you guys see that uh, that's how our picture is gonna the new picture is gonna look all right so we go ahead here on the third one and we put a three line here and in here we put a picture img we copy this guy from here card header uh, our img And we put it here in the card header okay so what I'll do before I copy I'm gonna put a a anchor text and at the moment I'm gonna leave it empty and I'm gonna leave the 
photo here so in the third one it's gonna be why I'm gonna I put this uh, anchor text here a because uh, what happens that I'm gonna show you guys in a sec uh, we're gonna put a hipster okay this is a hipsters done okay this is hipsters done because we don't have uh, this price or anything I'm not worried about that and you guys see here once I move around here I'm gonna see this hand coming because that's because of anchor text and this guy is here and once the user clicks on this one and the user is gonna go to the next page where these shoes are so this one don't, don't have if we move, go ahead and uh, put another anchor text around our uh, images and if you guys come here and put an anchor text a okay so what happens here get rid of the first a because we're going to wrap it around we're going to wrap around the pictures and once you guys go here and put your another picture here make sure this uh, a anchor text sitting both sides of the image because uh, this anchor text 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 you guys to the next page and if you put an a so sublime text is very good at uh, autocomplete they go auto complete for us the pictures and what we do is that we're gonna wrap around this uh, our pictures like that all right so we go ahead that's a uh, hipster that's one's done and we go ahead at the last one and we copy paste uh, we already copied and we're gonna paste and that's idea idea at the end so now all uh, the four pictures done so that's how our pictures this picture is smaller than the I think this one's but it doesn't matter we're gonna hide it okay this one's got more writing okay this one's got a little bit writing here okay we'll see how we're gonna fix that Okay, that one's done. So the third and fourth picture doesn't have this uh, star. So what we do is we're gonna add this uh, to the D, D flex MT3 and this one the, with the price. So we're gonna copy and we're gonna download here we're gonna come here on the footer and after this inside the footer okay you guys make sure it says card footer and you put a card footer here and you guys put a, that one the, on the fourth one okay now our uh, all the pictures got a price and there is some sort of description okay so now we go ahead and there is a um, the footer deflex uh, the footer border top border top gray 300 p4 we're gonna copy that one too and we're gonna bring it on the third and fourth so that's called footer we're gonna put it here okay so all done we check all right guys uh, as you guys can see our uh, product section is nearly complete uh, we have created their four pictures and uh, instead of call three and call four we're going to write something here and we have done all this uh, uh, this one's got a little i think a little bit more writing uh, I think there is it's got this this two's got a gap here because it's got a body we're gonna get rid of the body it's got a card body we don't want the card body 
okay so that's the this one and we're gonna get rid of the card body from here as well all right so with the card body is gone I think this picture is a little bit smaller than this ones so what we do is that we're gonna give a little bit height for this one so what happens on the I think that's the third one stylus chair I think this this one and you guys can uh, say put a style style and you guys give it a height uh, I'm not sure how what's the height say uh, uh, 100 I'm gonna put a 200 pixel okay so 200 pixels a little bit okay so we what we do is that we're gonna put a height on 200 on all of them to so, so all of them look the same so I'm gonna copy this style and I'm gonna add on all So all our pictures looks uh, perfect as you guys can see all the um, uh, the only this one in this one doesn't have the title and I'm gonna put the title now style chairs and this one's called three and we're gonna put a new shoes new shoes all right and the fourth one which is idea we're gonna put a new laptop we put a cool laptop all right um, you guys see this there is a header sitting here and this one's a bit smaller but we're gonna fix that as you guys can see this got a like it's idea I know but we just pretend this uh, laptop and it's um it's got a picture and it look cool and if you guys look here this is like a e-commerce website as you guys can see it's got a review and you put a different reviews on all of them so instead of uh say 4.3 we put a 4.0 and we go ahead and we go here on top somewhere where is the review say we put a 4.8 because this guy's new shoes got a more review better review and we put here 3.9 where is the review okay we put a 3.9 for chairs because a lot of people is not happy all right so looks like it's done and we come here and we look and you guys see that this got a 4.0 4.8 3.9 4.3 review so and if you guys don't know if you, through javascript we can bring all this uh, back and forth and once you guys uh, get more experience i'm going to show you guys how the actual uh, star things work but at the moment because we're learning bootstrap so this is the just a placeholder for this um, uh, type of data and that's how we put our price and that's how we're gonna put it inside the, the card so we're gonna fix up this stylish chair and here so that's h5 okay so that's h5 that's h5 as well that's h3 that's the reason 
that one's uh, coming big and that one's coming small so we need to change it to h5 so it looks uniform okay so this is look h5 as well and we look at this one is h5 as well so So now they all look the same. You guys can put a strong or you guys can put anything. So if you guys not happy with this one, you guys can put a small. And one sec. So instead of here, you guys copy this one and just put a small. And inside the small, just put this one. So all right, uh, that's how it looks, and you guys turn into gray as well. But if you guys go here, and you guys inside this small, just put a class, text muted, and you see that the sublime text helping us. We see how it looks, and you guys see it looks very faint. It's very faint and it matches this one. So you, we can go ahead. Either you guys do this one, or you guys leave it here. It's up to you. So because I want my text to look uniform I'm gonna copy this text and I'm gonna apply it to all my uh, all my writing here all the description and you guys see this description sitting here I'm gonna copy paste this and It's a uh, FW like text gray MT2. You can leave it that. I'm gonna leave it up to you guys which one you guys like the best. There is uh, different styles here, guys, and there is a text muted here, and there is uh, another one here which is um, FW light text gray MT2. Our text muted. I leave it up to you guys, whichever guy you guys like this one better or you guys like this one better you guys can put it inside your website uh, whichever text you guys like I know some of you guys might like this one some of you say no I like this one but I'm gonna leave both one this side but the main thing is our, our structure our structures looks okay so and then um, it, it looks perfect all the photos the same all the same height and all of the writings here everything's uh, they look the same and there is a reviews here uh, with the pricing you guys can go and change different price I leave it 500 no problem uh, that's it all right guys that's it for this video if you guys got any question or comment leave it uh, in the comment box otherwise I'll see you guys in the next video and bye